following Steve Moore right now and he has gained access to private property he got permission from the landowner for a place that we can launch our kayaks for a day of red fishing so the, uh, oh. the rule here is that it's easy to eat well it's, it's gonna be pretty muddy getting out but uh, usually where we want the tide to be is like two or three posts up Okay. From that. So we've got time. We're here in plenty of time. All right. How muddy is that? It's pretty muddy. You're going to sink in probably this far. Oh, is that? I was, I was figuring oh, over no, my no, knees. No, no, no. And what we're going to do is Maybe we're going to go right over, ankle. Okay. right over there. we got to go around the sandbar. Then we'll stop up there to pick up some bait and loop back around. And the super duper top secret fishing spot is over on the other side. Okay. Um, my Hobie's a little heavier. There's so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but you're a beefy guy. Okay, well, yeah, I can do it by myself <laughs> if I want to. If you got it in your van, the three of us will get it out. All right. <laughs> wow. So far, so good. You remember the first time that I tried to go fishing with Steve Moore of Kayak Cacks Fishing? Things got weird. I mean, I obviously intimidated the guy. I was in a panic that Steve was going to come visit. And the pressure of getting him on a fish was insurmountable today. You know, he was worried that he wasn't going to be able to put me on the fish. On top of that, we had terrible thunderstorms rolling in. The day was a bust, so we kind of hung around his house. It got really, really weird. And, and quite frankly, you know, I don't know if he was... I don't know if he was doing any of that, but he got physical with me. Here. I ain't gonna tell people. To Come on, man. He got aggressive with me. He thought that he could pass off us fishing in the back of his pickup truck. This ain't fishing, Steve. He got a single bite yet. That Panther Martin works pretty good on truck. And that I'd go along with it. That was some crazy stuff. Before the day was out, he actually threw me off his property. Hey, Steve, I'll see you later, man. And by the way, fishing with you sucks. Well, it sucked with you too. It you sucked. jigs me. Oh, man. Get that out of here. It was crazy. Uh, a friendship was almost ruined before it started. However, we did do the proverbial, you know, the bros makeup, the kiss and makeup, had a nice lunch, and we vowed to put all this behind us and try again to go red fishing at his super secret spot. So I was really jacked up because today looked like a beautiful day. He was going to take me to his secret spot. Dick, we're taking sea fishing on our best spot today. What kind of guarantees do we need that he's not going to tell anybody where we are? It's got to be a with a boat like that, it's got to be a super duper, highest level, no divulgence of information. I, I'm not going to tell anybody. I, sw I swear to God, I swear to God, I ain't going to tell nobody. I promise. I don't trust you, Steve. Come on, man. We, we got to have you sign our short version of the agreement. Okay, you guessed it. It got freaking weird again. What is wrong with that freaking guy? And by the way, the doctors say the bandages will come off soon. I'm not even going to try to explain. Just just watch the video. You'll see what happens. Are you there, kidding there me? A contract? Absolutely. And, you're, and if you violate this, some of the penalties are that you got to watch house hunters all day on home and garden. Oh. Or repeated showings of the Bridget Jones. Oh, come movies. on, man. Yep. It, it's got to gotta be it. You got to be freaking kidding me, Steve. And you're not allowed to see what's in here till after you sign it. Oh, figures. Okay. Oh, oh, come so, on. So do you want to fish with us? I want to fish. Let's go fish. I'll sign it. Give me a pen. Hey, pen? Yeah, a pen. Give pen. me a pen. I'll sign it. You got to sign this thing in blood. Oh, come on. 
That's ridiculous. Nope. That's the deal. Let's do it. Okay, Steve, sign in blood. I can't believe I'm doing this, Steve. This is ridiculous. Ow! More God! pain. God! More pain. More Are you pain. Ah! Ah! God, that, that's enough! Okay. Oh, God, Steve! Okay, I need, need your thumbprint. Uh, give me some ice. Give me some ice. What I got to do? What I got to do? What? What now? What now? Palm print oh, right there. Oh Lord, I'm, I can't believe this. Oh, that, that hurts, man. Okay, I've got your DNA. You can go fishing. You got any ice? Ain't no ice. Oh Where God. Do you think we are. This this is alpha male fishing. Go. You'll change your mind when the wind's so bad, and I have to pull you in with that heavy Hobie. There you go. My foot's stuck, I can't move it. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> I thought I was going to leave mine in the mud right now. That's smart. Okay, so while Steve and Dick are up there talking, I think I'm gonna use this as a teachable moment to Steve because I heard him do a woo once and uh, I was really weak. Uh, I wasn't proud of his woo. I'm gonna go up there and see if I can uh, give him some one-on-one -on -one instruction on how to do a proper woo. Hey, listen, man, since we're not gonna be fishing side by side, um, I need to know when you catch a fish, and I think the best way to do that is to maybe let out a woo. Uh, no, <laughs> Dick, did you see that? I saw that. That was pitiful. That was not an That was pathetic. Well, I only had seven jumps. You had a bazillion, right? Holy crap, man. An ex lieutenant colonel, and that's that was the woo? All right, try, just, just try it again. Woo! We got some work. That was better. Let's do it again. Woo! <laughs> You're getting better. Let me show you how to do it. Here, you take okay. the camera. Okay. All right, when you catch a fish, it's got to come from deep within. You've got to show your excitement, man. I'm excited I caught that fish. Woo! Whoa. That's a woo. All right. Okay, you saw my woo. Now, you, you got it now? I think I got it. All right, let's do it. I'm motivated. Do it. I'm charged up. Let's do it. Get it for the car. Do it. Woo! Yeah! yeah. yeah. High five. Yeah! yeah. Woo! 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 Okay, Steve, that's enough. Okay. Yeah, I'm about we're to good. have a heart attack here. Okay, we're good. We're okay. good. Jeez, man. Okay, we're all set up. Steve and Dick are out that way. I'm set here. The tide's really starting to come in now. So, we all got live bait out, and now we're just waiting on the redfish. Steve says this is the redfish superhighway, so come on reds, let's do it. Alright, fish on.
Beautiful little fish. These things are so pretty. Look at that spot. mud minnows. There he is. Alright, let's go. There he goes. Probably a ray. He ain't running much. As luck would have it, the weather ran us off the water again. I had a great time fishing with Steve Moore of Kayak Hacks Fishing and his friend Dick. Had a great day on the water. Right here, about the time we got in, the bottom literally fell out on us. Well, thank goodness it rained just enough to get us soaked. <laughs> oh, geez. Well, we caught fish. That's the key. Yes, sir, buddy. And, uh... Even with the blindfold on, I know you won't give it up. Uh, there's no way I would have got my phone <laughs> GPS out and marked that location. There, you, you don't have to worry about that at all. I'll put a link to Steve's video of our day on the water in the description. Go check him out. He has a great YouTube channel. He is a DIY jack of all trades everything concerned the kayak so you'll get a lot of value from his youtube channel all right y'all that is it thanks for watching and i'll see you next time but i had a blast man thank you yep appreciate come it again come again all right i mean that you gotta invite me again well you know the uh the agreement is good forever is it yeah so as long as you're with me that all right you don't disclose you don't have to watch that house hunters for a whole okay day. all right okay <laughs>